hello everyone and welcome back to my channel this is angel with angel spiritual messages this is going to be a mid-monthly love reading for the sign of gemini and those with gemini placements um keep in mind reverse the rules as need be cross watchers you're always welcome um, but please be nice in the comments and if it doesn't resonate please check your other placements it is going to be full tarot so we're going to go ahead and get started um spirit if you would please give me the messages for the greatest and highest good for the sign of gemini and the person that they are watching this reading for if you would spirit please give me a, the messages for gemini and the person that they're watching this reading for for their mid-february monthly love reading one more all right thank you spirit let's see what we have gemini king of cups page of pinnacles ace of wands knight of swords the hermit the empress all right so what i'm getting here um gemini is that um i'm seeing you sitting here in this king of cups energy you have a lot of love uh, for the person that you are watching this reading for cross watchers if you would please reverse the roles if you need to um and you are expecting that this person will come in and provide you with some type of offer um, of a new beginning with the ace of wands um, this person does look like they will be coming in and that they will be rushing in um, to have a conversation with you but just keep in mind with this knight of swords this person is coming in they're rushing in fast and very very quick and they may rush out just as quick okay and let me tell you why uh, because this person is currently in the hermit mode. Okay. They're currently in hermit mode. Trying to think about this situation. They're racking their brain. Trying to figure out whether or not this is something. That they can bring um, into uh, union or balance with you. Um, the king of cups is Cancer Scorpio Pisces. The page of pentacles is Taurus Virgo Capricorn. The ace of wands Aries Leo Sagittarius. Knight of Swords is going to be Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. The Hermit is going to be Virgo. And the Empress is going to be Taurus and or Libra. There is an Empress here. Okay. There is an Empress here that is uh, wreaking havoc on this situation. I don't see you as this Empress. Not because you're not. But this is a feminine energy around this situation that's wreaking havoc over this connection. And it has... This person in hermit mode, your presence and this presence has this person in hermit mode trying to figure out what they need to do. But this person is, is racing towards you because they have something they have to say. Okay. So spirit, if you would, please show me on the right how does Gemini's person feel about them? Eight of Pentacles. Knight of Pentacles. And the Star. Okay. So it looks like this person sees you as someone with this Eight of Pentacles that they want to work with. That they want to invest in. This may also be someone that you work with. Not necessarily. doesn't have to be. But if it is, um, it may be someone that you work with. But this person wants to put in work with you. Um, this person is moving very, very slow um, with giving you a firm offer. Although they may be coming in with the swords up. That means they're coming in to speak a truth to you. But as fast as they come in to speak this truth, the quick they're going to be gone. But... In their mind, they are thinking about coming in with this solid offer, okay? Because they see you as a star. They see you as someone that um, is a wish for them. Something that is typically 
um, they would view in their mind as unattainable. And that's the reason that they're in this hermit mode, because there's an empress here. And, and I'm going to find out in just a second who this empress is, but you have made an impression on this person. This person has high regard for you. And it's not just a sexual thing. This person sees a solid situation with you and they want um, to try to possibly invest in it. But something has them in this hermit mode. Okay. Eight of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Knight of Pentacles, the same. The star card is going to be a possible Aquarius. Spirit, if you would, show me who this Empress is. Queen of Pentacles. World card. Nine of Swords. This is someone that this person was originally dealing with. Okay. Uh, per, uh, possible Capricorn. Taurus or Virgo. Cycle ended with this person cycle ended with this person and it has your person in this nine of swords because they are confused they are up at night worried and constantly thinking about this person and also you okay so this is this person's ex they may have children with this person they may have been married to this person there is some type of connection here that puts this person as an empress this person is not an empress because they are an empress. They are an empress because either they are, they are a mother or a father to the, to the children of the person you're dealing with. Or they portrayed themselves as, as an empress. But this queen of pentacles is that person. That's this person right here. Your person sees this person as the Queen of Pentacles. They think that this person was solid and stable and this cycle closed out and now they're in their heads about it because there is still a such you that sits over here. Person in hermit mode trying to make a decision about a new beginning. And I think they're very, very confused on who they're going to offer this new beginning to. But they do want to come in and talk to you. Spirit, if you would please show me how this person feels. No, show me how Gemini feels about this person. Nine of Pentacles in reverse. Six of Swords in reverse. Three of Wands in reverse. Hmm. Gemini. And then at the bottom of the deck, I have the four wands. You're in a commitment with this person. You are in a commitment with this person. This, and I'm going to go ahead and put this up here. You're in a, I'll put it over here somewhere. You're in a commitment with, with this person. You are in a commitment with this person. You are not single. This is the nine of pentacles in reverse. That means you are not a single person. You're in a relationship either with this person or or with someone else and I'm thinking that it's a possibility that both of you have someone else okay and that's what has this person in their head I'm about to find out over here in just a second but this person has a lot of love for you and I'm thinking they have already ended this situation with this person that they were dealing with but I see you still being over here very much alive and committed to something else or cross watchers reverse the roles Gemini this may be you that ended something with someone else that has you a little sad because the cycle has closed out and and now the person that you thought you were going to be with is over with and you ran into someone new and this person is still in a commitment there's a home and a family here okay they're not trying to move forward with anything they're not trying to move in the calmer waters. They're not. Look. These are all in the reverse. This person has someone. This is this nine of pentacles is someone who is not single. This person is not trying to move away from this situation. And they're not waiting on anything. They're not waiting on the situation to change. Because they already have the four of wands with someone else. And this is what has 
this person that you're dealing with in their head. Okay. All right. Spirit, if you would show me. Show me. Um, Gemini's person's energy for this third party. No. Show me the third party's energy for Gemini's person. Four swords. Four cups. Nine of wands. All right. So what I'm seeing here. Four swords. Four of cups. Nine of wands. This person has gone through a, a few cycles with your person. And it, 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 they, they're thinking about it constantly, but they don't look like they want to um, accept an offer from your person. Not at the moment. Doesn't say that they won't because they're in the nine of wands, the wounded warrior. I'm wounded, but I'm not out for the count is basically what this person is saying. Okay. So although it looks like it's done over here with regard to your person, this person says it's not. But this is how your person feels about you. This is how your person feels about the, the person that they're with. And this is how you feel about your person. You know they're in this commitment with this person. Hmm. You know they're in a commitment with someone. And if you don't know, you felt it. They're in hermit mode right here, trying to figure out which direction they're going to go in. Because although they thought they closed this cycle out with this person, they're still worried about it over here. And this person is saying in this nine of wands energy, I'm not done yet. We've been through hell and high water, but we're not done yet. And you know they're together. I thought this was both of you guys in something. No, you know this person was taken. And you knew that this person was in a higher level of commitment, either married, engaged, or living with someone. This empress also showing up as the queen of pentacles. But you love this person. You love this person. And this person has a great fondness for you. They see you as something that they want a wish hmm all right show me more show me more spirit what's going on over here with Gemini's person and this third party give me more king of pentacles eight of cups the devil all right Your person walked away from the situation because there was some toxic energy happening. There was either some addiction, some controlling or codependency going on in this situation. And your person walked away from it. And although it keeps them up at night, they feel like they have made the right decision by walking away from this situation with this person. Okay. Let me give you guys some, some of the Zodiac signs I see on the board. Um, the... Queen of Pentacles is Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Of course, you know the world card is going to be the fixed signs. Taurus, Aquarius, Leo, and Scorpio. Um, the Nine of Swords. Excuse me. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Devil Energy, Capricorn. Eight of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. King of Cups, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Over here, Nine of Wands is going to be Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. The Cups, Energy, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. The Four of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Four of Wands is going to be Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Um, the Swords energy, again, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Pinnacles energy, um, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Here's the thing. This is you and this um, King of Cups, male or female, it doesn't matter. 
This is your energy. This person is looking towards the future to try to offer you this new beginning because I think they are really accepting that this situation is over with. Give me more over here with this person, this third person, I mean, third party. How are they? What, give me more on how they're feeling about uh, Gemini's person. All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Okay. This person feels like they've invested in the situation and, and they don't want it to be over with. But they do feel like they're out in the cold with this Pentacles energy. They feel like they've put in work. They have built something with this person. And now they feel like they're out in the cold, although they still really, really have a lot of love for this person. Okay? Because this used to be their divine counterpart. The person that you're dealing with. Used to be. But something happened with it. And I want to say it was probably about money. Because I'm seeing these pinnacles here and this five of pinnacles means uh, financial trouble if you ask me. So I think they fell on hard times and this person says, I got to go. Your person said they had to go. Okay. Give me more on how Gemini feels about this person. You want long term? There's the hyphen. You made your decision. To balance the situation out with this person. You want long term with this person. You've already made your decision. You know what you want. Give me more on how this person feels about Gemini. They want to they want to do an equal give and take um, with this six of Pentacles. They want to balance out the scales with you. They want the ten of cups with you. They see they see beauty in this connection with you see this was a struggle over here for them okay this is their person over here this is how they feel about their person there was lots and lots of turmoil and chaos over here a lot of thinking a lot of overthinking some money issues some addiction issues over here yeah they close this cycle out with the world card with this person Mm, yeah, they definitely did that. Okay. All right. Give me one more for how they feel about Gemini. Six of Cups. This is your ex, possibly. This is a ex returning to you. This is a ex returning to you. This person left thinking that they were uh, following a divinely guided connection. Only to find out. That wasn't the case. Got over there. Started a whole bunch of arguing and fighting. That nine of wands. Whole lot of overthinking. Money issues. Addictive behaviors. Couldn't sleep at night. Couldn't rest well. And this person said, I got to go. And they left. They booked with the eight of cups. They left that situation with this person. Mm -hmm. They left the situation with this person. They're on their way back. They're on their way back. You read it right. This person is on their way back. Show me, uh, Spirit, the action they're going to take towards Gemini. Justice. They're going to balance out the scales. They knew they were wrong. They knew that they were wrong in their actions towards you. They knew it. They knew when they selected this person over here, over here. This is their thoughts about that person. And this is that person. They know that they selected a hot mess. Okay. And I think all the while you knew that this person would be back. You knew they were going to come back. You knew what they were signing up for and you knew it wasn't going to work. Show me more. They're heartbroken. They're heartbroken. They are heartbroken. They're heartbroken by the fact that they chose wrong and they know that they have caused an issue that is going to make it very hard for them to come in with this page of Pentacles and this ace of wands. That's why they're in this hermit mode, but they coming in quick and fast with this um, knight of swords because they need to talk to you. 
See, and when they come in quick and fast, it is just, and with this page of pinnacles, it is just to test the pulse of the situation. They want to know whether or not you're going to talk to them. Okay. They know they put you in this situation. They know they broke your heart when they chose this person over you. They know that. What else? They're going to try to balance things out with you. They're going to try to balance. This is not a juggle. It would be a juggle if I didn't see this situation over with. It's a balance. The two of pentacles in this case, because of the cards that are around it, is a balance. They're trying to balance this situation with you. Because you can't be in a situation that's unbalanced. And if you look at this two of pentacles, it is unbalanced. This person is coming in to try to balance the situation out. Just like the justice card, the scales are balanced here. This person knows that when they come back, your heart is going to be broken. That you're still going to be sad about what they did. And it is off balance currently. But they're coming in to try to make this right. Okay. There it is. There it is. Cup runneth over. Love. A love offer. They're coming in. They're going to make the situation right. And at the bottom of the deck, the Ten of Swords. The ending of a tough cycle. This deck has two Ten of Swords. One is the Ten of Swords, the end of a tough cycle, and I'm moving on about my business. This one is the Ten of Swords and everything is fine, which means that although it has been a tough cycle and that cycle is ending, you are willing to work this situation out with this person. Okay. You're willing to work this situation out with this person. Gemini, this is what I have for you. This is what's going to happen with you. Uh, reverse the roles as you need be. Um, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. I hope this gives you peace. I hope it gives you clarity. You kind of had me confused a little bit, but we got it. Um, I hope it gives you direction and I hope it gives you clarity. Thank you so much for your time and I'll see you on the next one.